In this tutorial, we're going to look at how to easily create a connection string for SQL Server. So first off, right click on your desktop and create a new text document. You're going to want to change the extension of the text document. If you don't see it currently, that's okay. Just open your Windows Explorer window, go to the View tab, click on Options, the folder options, click on view, or you don't want to look for hide extensions for known file types. If that's checked, you want to uncheck it. Click apply, then click OK. At this time we're going to want to change the extension from txt to udl. And click yes. Double click the file, and now you get a new window, data link properties. From here, you can choose your server name. You can choose whether to use Windows authentication, or you can use your a specific account in your SQL Server authentication. We'll just use Windows for now. And then select the database that you want. You can also go to the provider tab and change what type of OLED, OLEDB provider. For now we're just going to keep the SQL Server. So go back to the connection string and let's test it. And it was able to successfully connect to the SQL Server. So click OK and click OK again. You're going to want to change the extension of the document one more time and change it back to txt. Click yes and then just open the file. As you can see this is our connection string based on the data that we provided. And that's how you create a connection string the easy way.